When it comes to stemming the tides of genocide, the United States has a checkered past. Candidate Barack Obama promised he would change that, promising in 2008, for instance, that he would use the G word, genocide, when talking about the slaughter of nearly one and a half million Armenians at the hands of the Ottoman Empire a century ago, even if U.S. ally Turkey objected. There was a, uh, a genocide that did take place uh, uh, against the Armenian people. Uh, it is one of these situations where we have seen a constant denial on the part of the Turkish government and, and others that this occurred. Obama aide and current United Nations Ambassador Samantha Power wrote a powerful book about the refusal of the U.S. to stop genocide around the world. She said in a campaign video what President Obama's boldness signified. His willingness as president to commemorate it um, and certainly to uh, call a spade a spade and, and to speak truth about it. Today, Armenian Genocide Remembrance Day, for the sixth time in a row, President Obama deferred to Turkey and refused to use the word he promised to use, though he noted, quote, I have consistently stated my own view of what occurred in 1915, and my view has not changed. President Obama called the Armenian Genocide undeniable in a 2008 letter to the Armenian-American community. Apparently, it is quite deniable.